Hi, I'm Cleve Rickshecker. I'm Executive Director of Capital Crossroads Special Improvement District, and I'm standing in what is probably the most exotic place in all of Central Ohio, which is Lynn and Pearl Alleys uh, near the intersection of Broad and High. You know, I like to think of this area as our little piece of Paris, and I've always felt that this would be just a fabulous place for small, independent, and startup retail uh, operators to locate. And so we've done a project in the alley uh, that includes improvements that are designed to encourage retail development uh, and also enable retail development. So uh, what we've done is a series of things that include new lights, uh, lights in the alleys, entry signage, dumpster enclosures, which are really important to get some of the clutter off these alleys. And we work with uh, the Downtown Residents Association to restore two street clocks uh, uh, in the alley system. And so the idea is that over, over time, we'll see the conversion of buildings that are very uh, narrow and deep from a single storefront facing High Street or Third Street to multiple storefronts facing in the alley. And believe it or not, the alley system has enough retail space to accommodate up to 45 small retail operations that are the size of some of the really small retailers in the short north at the corner of North High Street and Lincoln. Those are 200 square foot retail boxes, and we can create a lot of those in this alley system. And what that would allow is for us to create the conditions that allow independent retail to locate in downtown, because right now, there is no market for chain retail, with a few exceptions like CVS. But there is a supply of independent retailers who would love to locate in downtown, because there's a big retail market here. Uh, and yet, there are very few efforts being made to accommodate independent retail with affordable space in an area of consumer traffic um, that's clustered with other retail space. We think this is the location where we can begin to grow retail in downtown because like the short north, somebody's got to take the responsibility to actually create the consumer traffic and create the retail district. And we're seeing some of that happen near Gay and High Street. And clearly the alley system will help uh, speed that process up so that in a few years we'll have what may be the most exciting retail district in all of Central Ohio.